I Wanna Dance With Somebody is the biopic focused on the life and career of Whitney Houston. Like other biopics before it, specifically Rocket Man, Bohemian Rhapsody, Respect and Elvis, I Wanna Dance With Somebody has a formulaic and generic structure to it, following familiar plot points and beats of other famed biopics. The result is a movie that has entertaining moments but so often feels like a cash grab. At the heart of the movie is Naomi Aki's performance as Whitney Houston. Naomi is fantastic in the role, bringing the late icon to life and imbuing her with a lot of charm and wit and likeability. We see her romantic relationships, her family bonds, her career and more, and Naomi makes each of these facets of her life interesting and engaging from her point of view. Sadly, the story lets the movie down. Instead of focusing in on a key moment or event or time, it tries to convey the entire life and career of Whitney Houston. There are frequent time jumps forcing viewers to play catch up, with certain events and moments being skimmed by and overlooked. For example, her introduction to drugs is almost completely absent, instead being introduced as a major long-term factor very late in the movie. It's an odd omission considering its importance to the story. The same goes for her sexuality which is explored well at first, but then completely pushed to the side without ever being mentioned or explored again. Perhaps there's an extended cut of the movie that rectifies these issues, but so much of the movie seems to be focusing in on key points, rushing from one to the other like a checklist rather than a natural flow of a story. In many ways, I Wanna Dance With Somebody feels like someone had a lot of trivia about Whitney Houston and then tried to forge that into a narrative, connecting each point to the next. It doesn't always feel like there was a story to be told in the movie and that the filmmakers did not know what or how to focus their attention. The film ultimately lacks a wow factor, a unique perspective or style. It's a by the books generic biopic with predictable beats and moments that feel ripped from other biopics. Guess what? A bad person comes into their life and changes it forever. Guess what? They have a big downfall and then they have a huge triumphant finale. It's very typical biopic formula. The musical moments are fun, Naomi is good, as is the rest of the cast, but there's a lack of heart and purpose to the film that really lets it down. 